Well, good evening and happy Monday, everyone. We are delighted to see you guys here. Um, thank you, everyone, for joining in from your day. Uh, your choice, and it is a choice every time we come together on a Monday night, when we choose to be together as teams and Juice Plus family, it does mean a lot. Um, so thankful that you're taking the time to be connected to the Juice Plus family and to the community and all that's going on, because there is a lot going on in our world. And each week when we come together, it is uh, as a team and as a Juice Plus family, because we've got extended family on here. Uh, our purpose is to keep our focus on the life-changing mission of inspiring healthy living around the world. And every time we share our story, every time we invite somebody, every time we share a resource, we are sharing and making a difference in people's lives. So we're the Mission Possible team, which is a growing team of inspired individuals. I call us ambassadors, definitely dedicated for change for a healthier tomorrow for as many as possible. And we have so many great things going on. And we just I just got a call today and I'm not seeing her on here. And I know she was going to be on here, but oh, I see Margot's here and she'll share next week. I just got a call today from corporate that our own Margot Lopetri has been promoted to QSSC. So we want to give a shout out to Margot. Um, she recently retired and has been She's got already had an organization. Paula and her team are on her organ in her organization, but she's doing some extra work, adding some extra people in, and uh, she's going to be getting a thousand dollars in a title reward. So how cool is that um, for um, starting off the month of August? So we'll give a shout out and we'll recognize Margot next week. And then I do want to share my screen just a minute because, as you know, many of you may or may not know that the company is doing a challenge or a focus in July, August, and September. And the Juice and the Mission Possible team has also adopted a challenge for Healthy Starts. So this is the Healthy Starts where when an adult adds Juice Plus to their diet, capsules and fruits and vegetables, then a child between four and 26 can get it for free. I think we all know about this. So our goal is 50 new families to be uh, to invite 50 new families in August and September. And that's been posted in Facebook and on the Boxer chat. And every time you do that, here's a little graphic that Cammie made for us. Post this and I'll record it. And there's going to be some recognition and some prizes on it. So be, uh, be sure to post that. But I want to share with you guys, we're off to we're off to an incredible start with this. And we had two more added in there today. See if I can do this. Two more added today, so I don't have that in there. But we're already at 11 new healthy starts, uh, and we're just kicking off August. So thank you to everybody that's out there. We'll recognize all the names next week. That was just to kick us off. Now, you may have heard that tonight we're talking Luminate. Let's talk Luminate. And I cannot believe that last was it Friday, Thursday, what was it? What day was it? Last Monday, last Monday, the company threw out a, a little incentive for us. Uh, we were we were getting ready to take a vacation. I made day drive so I could work the phone the whole time I was in the car letting as many people know as possible that if you bought the, thir the um, two boxes, the 30 count of Juice Plus Luminate, you got a box free. Who did that? Who got their free box? I mean, how cool was that? And um, so I'm excited about what we're doing and making a difference for people's lives. So tonight we want to talk Luminate ingredients and benefits and stories and and um, key key ingredients. So Sally Reinemer is going to direct our call on that. So I'm going to pass it over to Sally. Hi, everybody. So um, as you can tell, how many on here have at least tried Luminate or are totally addicted at this point. <laughs> <laughs> I say, I'm, yeah, uh, basically everybody. Yeah, it's true. It's easy to get addicted to feeling better energy, to feeling more productive, to feeling more focused. I mean, I had one this afternoon, had a lot of things that I wanted to bring my attention to. And so I took my Luminate in my favorite way, and we'll share about that a little bit later. Everybody's got some of their favorite ways to, to do it. Um, and 
it just did it again. It just helped me stay focused. And one of, I was thinking of um, this customer of mine, my first, I think it was my first Luminate customer, just Luminate. And this uh, man is extremely ADD and ADHD, um, never medicated, never wanted to do that, but he's pretty, ooh, as his wife puts it. Um, so she took some home to him and he called and left me this message. She said, he said, Sally, I don't know what you're selling, <laughs> but I want more of it. <laughs> it's my go-go juice. <laughs> He said, I cannot believe how focused and productive I am. And I it was my first like kind of like, wow, I think we're really, this is important. This isn't just instead of your cup of coffee or my cup of tea. There's something else going on here. And so we wanted to just take some time tonight to hear some stories, to get some information, and then we'll do more of this because we're only going to learn more about it, about our brain productivity drink. This is a term that you can start putting in your brain when you talk to people, our brain productivity drink. So let me share my screen quickly. And so I'm going to, isn't it interesting how sometimes things get lost? <laughs> they were there and then they're just not. Anyways, I will get that back up. But I wanted to start off with um, what is juice plus luminate? And these are two terms that, uh, to be honest, I hadn't heard of before. Um, and it's just something that you, new terms we learn, right? We just learn them. And it takes a few times of, of, of practicing, but we learn them. So it's a powerful blend of nootropic. So the thing to, to, to connect the dots, at least for me, if you think neuro, except it's noo. So it has to do with brain, neuro, it's not neurotropics though, it's nootropics. And adaptogens, well, they do the, just what they say. They help us adapt. Adaptogens are ingredients to help us adapt to our physical, mental, and environmental stress, stressors. They come from herbs, roots, mushrooms, and other plant sources. And the nootropics, or things that support our brain, support cognitive function, helping with mental alertness, mental energy alertness and focus. And they also come from plants. I mean, we are not deviating, right? We are all about getting more plants into people. Now, both the documents that I'm going to share screen on are in our boards. They're also in the hub, but they're in our boards under Luminate, lots of great resources. And we're just finding some, some new videos that are there as well that we, that we wanna make sure people are aware of. So I am going to stop share on that and find this other one that was up and then decided to go away. Okay, I will share again. All right, so the Juice Plus Facts. So this is also another great document. I give this to people when I give them a sample or if they've just ordered it, I, I will send an email and attach it. I love the basic information on here. So we're just gonna kind of follow through. We've got people that are gonna share um, their stories as well. They're gonna share how, what's their favorite way to drink it. Uh, so, but we're just gonna let this kind of guide us. So key facts. One of the things that's different than our um, fruit and veggie um, functional powder capsules is that you feel this right away. Not, it, not necessarily immediately, but um, they're, what they're reporting is over about 60 minutes, you will begin to feel some of these. It tastes great. Um, we have scientifically proven ingredients uh, that that benefit us, the Alpinia gal galanga, and it doesn't matter if we know how to pronounce these or not. It's okay. We don't have to be perfect. Um, we just know that it helps our brain and it helps our mood and who doesn't need that? Um, 
So the key ingredients, um, coffee berry. This is really important, I think, to distinguish for people because some of us, I drink a cup of tea every day. I am not caffeine sensitive. Um, some people are very caffeine sensitive. So if you are, a person is, I always recommend they start out like with half a one. Uh, and, um, but I always explain to people and all, and this is all in, in that, that ingredients sheet, it talks about the coffee, it's the whole coffee berry. So again, it's the whole fruit. It's not just the extracted coffee bean that's roasted and then ground and then you get the hit of caffeine from it. It's really the whole co coffee berry. So although there is some caffeine in it, it operates a little differently in our bodies. Um, the, as we talked about the Alpinia galanga, mushrooms, a lot of people are very familiar with these already. Um, the lion's mane mushrooms, when I was doing an event here um, and I mentioned um, the lion's mane, several people already were familiar. So a lot of these things people are very familiar with and the, the Luminate ingredients document really goes into depth with some really wonderful um, information about what it is and who has been utilizing this nutrient, whether it's an herb, a mushroom, um, uh, like sage leaf. I mean, did you know <laughs> that this is where to be a sage? It came from sage leaf because back, I think it was back in early Egyptian times, this is what they were utilizing to for, for brilliance, right? So um, a lot of these things are um, familiar and have been used a really long time. So we don't have to be shy if we aren't that familiar, read these documents, it's gonna build your belief. Um, so key benefits, um, enhanced mental clarity, mental energy, more focus, et cetera. So I'd like to ask, a few people, and I think while we do this, I will just stop share on this. And I just like to ask a few people have volunteered to share, and if there's anybody else that wants to jump in quick and just share what you've been experiencing, uh, what you're loving about it. And I think we will start with Hannah. This is um, Sharon's niece before you get called out to deliver a baby or something. <laughs> Welcome, Hannah. Hello. Can everybody hear me okay? Yes. Perfect. So as she mentioned, um, I am a midwife assistant right now. I'm training to be a midwife. So this has become my middle of the night on the way to catch a baby drink. Um, a lot of times I have to go from completely asleep to as alert and clear as I can be. And I'm almost always drinking one of these on the way to a birth. And last week we had two in 48 hours. And so I was sleep deprived. There was a lot going on. I didn't know what day it was, but that definitely helped me stay clear for, you know, the, the labor and delivery part. That was nice. Um, the taste is good. I personally drink it with a lot more than the eight ounces, just because I don't like a lot of flavor. Um, but it does taste good. And I don't get like a caffeine jittery mm -hmm. nastiness like I would with coffee. Um, so it's been a game changer for me, for sure. That's great. And you know, that brought up something, Hannah, as well, is it's another way to help people get more water, right? Because I, I also Absolutely. put in more water than just the eight ounces. I probably do at least 12 ounces, if not more, yeah. Well, can yes, I just I mean, say how I knew about Hannah? She sent me a picture one from the middle of the night, one night with her in a pack of Luminate. And it said, my new birthing buddy. <laughs> it was so cute. That's great. I love it. Thank you so much, Hannah. Um, okay. So who shall go next? I have uh, Paula. Thanks, Sally. Well, first of all, I love my Luminate hot the best. I don't know if anybody else, had, they're loving it hot, but that's my favorite way. But I actually wanted to share a story about my mom. She's retired, but she and my dad now pretty much have a full-time gig, I'll call it, chauffeuring the Amish community. 
in their neighborhood who's recently moved in and they get up super, super early to take them to their jobs. And then they're picking them up really late at night. And my mom sent me a text over the weekend, luminate to the rescue. (laughs) (laughs) because she had a long day of driving. She gets drowsy. Normally we're worried about her usually when she drives and I no longer worry about her. She's not a coffee drinker. She's super sensitive to it, but she can drink the Luminate without any of those, just like Hannah said, any of those weird jittery feelings. She doesn't have it. She's able to sleep well. And it's, it's my security blanket knowing that she's going to be alert when she drives. Great. Thank you. Um, Carol. Yes. The first time I tried it actually was on the way home from uh, our leadership conference. And I saved one for the drive home. I was going to be by myself and I knew I was going to be sleepy. And um, I had one of the little bottles of water I saved too. And so I just took a little drink out of that bottle, dumped it in, shook it up and drank it. And I wanted to be extra tired when I tried it just to see. Mm -hmm. And I'd say within five to 10 minutes, um, I was, you know, more alert. I wasn't drowsy like I was. So I keep it in the car all the time or in my purse. Um, but the other day I was on my way uh, to a BNI meeting and um, I'm the vice president of our chapter. So I have to do a lot of talking and it's been a very, very busy two weeks and I was just extra tired. And so I drank it right before the meeting and um as I shared this morning, I said, I actually sounded intelligent putting two, you know, two sentences together without trying to grasp for words and whatever. And that's really the first time I noticed that. Uh, I'm sure it helped before, but um, so I would recommend if anybody has a speaking engagement or anything like that, uh, just have you illuminate before you go. It's a good idea. Thank you. And we'll also open it up for any uh, one or two people to share spontaneously, but these are some people that that volunteered earlier today. Oh, BJ, you had a story to share. I did. This morning, I'll make it very quick. I woke up and we have our worship call on every Monday morning and it was beautiful and wonderful, but after the call, I just got a stinky attitude, I think, more than anything. We have so many things going on with our family, and I'm a fixer, and I just can't fix it right mm-hmm. now. And so I thought, okay, I had tried coffee. That didn't work because I needed that energy joke. So I said, okay, I've got more phone calls. I'm going to drink Illuminate before I get on. And I did, and I still had kind of that attitude, but all of a sudden, I'm on our call. We're talking about things we're going to be doing tonight. And there was something that just clicked in my brain. I felt it. I had a positive attitude. I was energized. I was excited about the day. I was thinking about all the wonderful things I could achieve today. And I have felt that way all day today. It's been absolutely amazing. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to start my day with Luminate instead of waiting to take it later in the day because I just felt so wonderful. It was amazing. So I'm very, I'm excited about it. Uh, It'll be my number one drink in the morning. So thank you. That's great, BJ. Thank you. Um, Sharon, you had... Uh, I'll just share a quick story. A friend of mine shared with me last week, uh, her husband's in a memory care unit. She brings him home on the weekends and she went to pick him up last weekend or weekend weekend before last. And he it's the first time he did not know who she was. Mm -hmm. And obviously it was heartbreaking. And when she got him home, he didn't know where he was either. So she gave him a luminate. She was just thinking maybe he's dehydrated. And she said within one hour, one hour, he went from not knowing who she was to calling her name. He knew exactly. And, you know, I don't want to make any claims, but if it's if it opens and improves the brain pathways, it cannot hurt. That's what Lisa Pebble says in her video. The nopotropics improve brain pathways. So she said he knew her name. He knew where he was. And that he was able to carry on at least some de- decent conversation at dinner where he had not been able to before. So she took some back to the memory care unit and insisted and had a really hard conversation with one of the 
people in charge that they would give him one a day. And I'm looking forward to hearing some next stories from my friend and what's going on there. But if you I think if we've got anybody struggling with um, any kind of dementia or challenge in the memory care area, we it cannot hurt. It absolutely cannot hurt. Right. Powerful. Yeah. I keep feeling like we don't know what we have. Right. We will find right. out exactly. as we, as we um, have more people utilizing it and whatever research the company uh, starts doing. Okay. Mark, you had something to share? Sure. <clears throat> My adult daughter in Iowa City is in a, a private practice psychological counselor, and it's her go to afternoon, three o'clock drink and she texted me today and said i was having a tough day a long day with many clients i took my luminate and i zoomed through the rest of the afternoon with wow. productivity That's so my, great. my wife who has a struggle with drinking liquids period has discovered that she can mix a about a 12 ounce glass of water and ice and luminate in the morning she just keeps sipping it all day long until it's gone. Oh, great. That's a good idea. Yeah. Well, that kind of segues unless someone else or someone else have something they'd like to quick share. Okay, Debbie. Well, I've got an example of focus. I have put off cleaning closets out and drawers out for so long. And I took my luminate and I am cleaning them out. So if you want your <laughs> closet or your drawers cleaned out, <laughs> go for it. It works. <laughs> it's a cleaning buddy. <laughs> yeah, my cleaning buddy. Right. Oh, that's great. Okay, so let's jump on to now how to mix it, drink it. What are your favorite ways to do that? Who wants to jump in? I, I will. I'll jump in. Yeah. This is Caroline. Good evening, everyone. Hi. Actually, my first drink was drinking it hot. I'm a tea drinker. And... um. I did it hot when we were there, you know, when they first launched it. I said, let me try it hot. And, oh, man, I love it hot. But also, when I have to pull those long hours at the salon from 9 to 9 or 9 to 10, I do illuminate in the afternoon about 2 or 3, and I be going as if I was still in my 20s. So <laughs> it does work. I'm telling you. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's fabulous. So try it hot. Sandy, you had... Yeah, I, I was doing it cold on ice and I do like it that way, um, but we've kind of switched my husband and I both to doing it hot first thing in the morning instead of our coffee. And it does dissolve the crystals much quicker, much easier when you have the hot water on it. And it definitely, I know it's doing good things in there, but I definitely get mood changes like BJ was talking about. I get up lifted a bit and um and it does help me focus too but my mother has been here for the last month and she had been using it a little bit before she broke her shoulder and she noticed immediately i mean within minutes she just felt her mood changed for yeah. the better but when she was living with me we started doing it hot slash warm um in the morning with her with her breakfast and it was great because instead of with ice, it, which I usually put a lot more water, it would take her so much longer to drink it. And I wanted her to get it all in her at once <laughs> as quickly as possible. And having it warm like that first thing in the morning um, really made a difference. She'd get it, drink it down very quickly and, you know, instantly just change everything up. So that's, that's great. Great, great. Nancy, I know you had a something you discovered. Just a little tip, yeah. As as uh, Sandy said, it does dissolve better in hot water. Um, Cheryl will remember this. The very first time we had our luminates, we were at the Indy conference and they had given them to us. We were at lunch and I had a, a cold bottle of water, poured that little sleeve of, of powder in there and shook and shook and shook. Do you remember, Cheryl? I was shaking and I just couldn't get everything dissolved in, in ice cold water. It, it, it tends to leave a few more clumps. So I had tried it warm and really, really enjoy it that way. I and I decided, okay, so now I put it in the glass. 
I add a little hot water first just to dissolve the the uh, granules. And then I add the cold water and ice and it and it's dissolved beautifully. When I drink it hot, it's a little bit too sweet for me. So I, I add a splash of lemon juice and that seems to cut the sweetness because I'm not a real sweet, I don't like sweet tea or anything like that. So that's, those are my tips. That's great. Yeah. And I have started doing that because my favorite things, no, it does not ruin the effects, Peggy. We aren't finding that it is. Good question though. Um, because my favorite thing is, so now I put a little bit of warm water in the bottom of a big glass and mix it up. I use the little frother sometimes, <laughs> mix it all up. Then a bunch of ice, especially in this heat, a bunch of ice and then sparkling water. And you need to pour it very slowly because <laughs> it really will, as Cheryl put it, have a, you'll have a science experiment. It will, that's what happened the first time I did it. I glug, 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 woo! So we learn as we go, but just pour in the seltzer. And then I put like a whole half a lemon juice in there. And oh my gosh, it is like. I like it, lemon juice. Incredible. It is incredible. So that's a great, it's like a mocktail, right? And we've got lots of great recipes. Does anybody else have, a, have another favorite thing that they're, how they're yeah. taking it? And um, you can also make a slushy out of it or a popsicle. We did that for our July um, summer class with teaching the summer treats. And so you just blend it with some ice cubes and it makes a slushy. So especially on these hot days, you can do a slushy and you can, I like it with a little lemon as well, but just the slushy part, you know, is very refreshing when it's 110 degrees outside. <laughs> um, yeah. But um, you can make it a popsicle as well. We just, I just mix it up and poured it in little popsicle oh. things and froze it so then you could be sucking on your illuminate popsicle while the kids are having their blueberry popsicles wow. <laughs> so huh, mm -hmm. cool. but I I find that when I do it with the hot water that it gives more of a berry flavor more of a sweet flavor and when I drink it cold it's more of a mango flavor I hmm. think interesting yeah did, did someone else come off me if they were going to share something quick I thought I saw somebody else no Maybe not, but there is a recipe book that is also in uh, the boards that has lots of great fun um, options and ideas in there as well. And one of the things that um, a number of us have been hearing talked about, and I know Sharon has one scheduled, I want to get one scheduled, um, is Illuminate Party. So we're going to be developing ideas around that as well. So uh, more to come so that we can share the good news. I mean, we always have Luminate when we have any kind of event, sourdough or salad in a jar. We always have it for samples uh, for people to try. And um, But having a whole focus on that, I think, could be really interesting. And with maybe some information about brain health and just all that kind of good stuff. So more and, to come. On all and Sally, that. Sally, I'm just going to add one thing because I went in today and did some research in our boards, in the Mission Possible boards, hit Luminate, go to the Luminate folder, and there is some Learn from Lisa Pebble videos. And they're like two and a half minutes, three minutes, and I've listened to two or three of them. One she did on the nopotropics and, and ashwagandha and adaptogens. And really... That's where I got it improves the brain pathway. She said some very key words and phrases that really spoke to me that I felt like I can use when I'm sharing this with people that sounds like more like I'm talking about, <laughs> like I know what I'm talking about. And so um, I would just encourage everybody to go in there and build. let's build our belief because I, I, I think we have agreed that we don't even know what we have a hold of here for sure. And just um, Jackie, yes, at a for a group, we just make a picture of it, and you're only pouring a little bit in a glass. So even for a big group, um, you know, one or two at the most of the Luminate packets, and mix it up, and then just have it available. Um, let's see, were there any other things? So I'm presuming everybody knows how to get to our boards. If you don't, just reach out to your team leader so that you can connect into those resources. And um, it's uh, just 
it's all there for us. So jump in, watch the videos, and um, we'll be having more conversation. As we get more information um, and develop ideas around the actual Luminate tasting parties and events, we'll definitely be discussing that as well. So anything else before we close? Sally, I was trying to get your attention. Oh, but okay. Like Sorry, you. Loretta. That's okay. I was just trying to say we have had a couple of uh, Luminate parties and we've done the mocktails and they are delicious. So we have done the margaritas, the mojitos, mm. and I want to say it was a sunny, so I can't remember this other, sunrise, some type of, but they are delicious. And it's not a, uh, and we made uh, like a pitcher full and we just poured them in, in these little shot glasses for people to taste. Yes. So that's great. Great, yeah, great. Actually, I'd like to add to that, Loretta, um, you can go to the dollar store and they sell little plastic uh, shot glasses. And at the dollar store, they also have shot glasses with little colorful dots on them and stuff. So you can, you don't, you can be fun. You don't have to just use a little clear shot glass. <laughs> Girl, wait a minute, Loretta. Now tell them the truth now. <clears throat> you had me to assist you, chef. And she had me squeezing <laughs> and alignment and everything to set up. I was like, look, girl, I'm about to go crazy. This is my, not my thing. So I suggest you have all that stuff done before your point in case you get someone like Loretta that's serious about details, you know. <laughs> Anyhow. Good point. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Right. Just like to quickly share. Yes, share yes we did have to invest a couple of things. And, and so I do suggest if you're going to have a large party to have a couple of pictures uh, already uh, made up. Yeah. And how I measured, I just measured according to the eight ounces. If you want to do like 16 ounces, you know, to use two packs of um, the Luminate. So each eight ounce add a pack of your Luminate. So, you know. Because they don't tell you on the recipe how many Luminate packs to, to mix for a large party. Right, right. Great. Thank you. And Debbie, you had something? I just wanted to say, kind of tying everything in, as Sharon mentioned, with the Healthy Starts earlier and then now the Luminate. And it was just said to check out, you know, our boards. I was on a call earlier that there was a presentation given on the healthy starts and people were saying they had no idea the information that was available to them on the hub. And I think that that is a big thing for all of us. We don't know every little thing is we're still discovering that's on our boards and to take the time to go in on the hub and really look at there's uh, presentation information, the whole bit. So we've got all this wonderful ideas to be able to use and information. So I just wanted to share that because it was brought up in this other call that people had no idea that was there. So definitely go and look at all of our resources because that's going to help all of us in sharing to make a difference for everybody else. So just wanted to share that. All righty. All right. I think we're done. Thank you, everybody. We, I mean, I loved hearing your stories, your experiences. Thank you for being here. Thank you for just bring in the light. Let's go out there and shine some light. Let's go illuminate up. Let's go let people know what a great product we have. Yeah. All right. See you guys next Thank week. You. Have a great week, Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Sally. Thank Very you. good. Thanks, Thank everybody. you, Sally. Thank you.